Okay, this is a pair of earrings that I made out of styrofoam. And how I did this is I cut thick styrofoam. Um, it was actually like a, a styrofoam um, tray. I bought those when I was doing a class with the kids and printing. And I have those left over, and usually they're covered with paint anyway. Um, and so I used different kinds of things. This was actually interesting because I got a bag of little Halloween, I guess it were skeletons, and I cut, no, they were bats actually, and I cut the little pieces um, up because I knew that I was going to use them not as bats, but as some kind of a surface um, to, to create texture, and so that's what I did, and then I put blue iridescent paint over the whole thing after that was dry. And um, then I painted the back and painted the edges. And then I added a little earring. These are little earrings that I had left over. So I added an earring that already, they were already earrings. So, you know, it was like I don't wear these kind of earrings. So, you know, I buy different things from thrift stores and stuff like that. So I added those as well. And those are my earrings. And people have told me they look like uh, glass they can't tell um, they don't really believe how light they are and so these will be at Eve Avery um, sometime um, after Thanksgiving I will also be doing a demonstration of how I do these earrings and uh, you'll be able to see me live outside of her her uh, boutique okay and then this is a, um, a necklace that I made um, out of uh, water bottle plastic. I think this was made from plastic that um, was echo plastic. It's made out of cornstarch so it's really easy to form and I love this because because this plastic is really soft and it's easy to work with and I have created this um, to make it look like it was very old, almost like an amulet and I added um, a um, lapis in the center. I used different kinds of wire. I used, um, oh, I don't know, this all kinds of stuff that's actually used. I used this collage material to embellish it. And I added, um, I actually wear it on a wire, um, but you can also wear this on a, um, if you want to wear this, you can actually wear this on a piece of leather. And that's probably the way I'll sell them is actually I'll have leather cord that I um, use to finish this piece. And so you can see, let's see if I can do the light a little bit better. You can see that it's um, quite interesting. And um, I like the idea of it being more like nature. And so um, I'll have photos of it so we'll actually see it better. But this is the other pendant I made. And then the other thing I made was this little piece, which is, um, is a little wise woman. Um, and I like her because she also is made to look very ancient. Um, she is symbolic of the goddess of the forest. And um, she's made with echo plastic also, the stuff that can't, you know, turns into cornstarch. And um, I added moss, and I actually had a little face that I did when I was doing shrink plastic. I had half of a face left in my collage stash, and I used that also because I just thought it just needed a woman's face on it. So this is actually another pendant that I use. Um, and you can see also I recycle the wire. This is wire that's not like wire you buy for jewelry, but it's very, um, you know, simple wire that I found um, around. I'm not sure what it was really. But it's wire. It's not gold wire. It's, it's already aged, and I like that, that look. So that is what I did with this one. And then this one here is a pen that... Um, it's interesting how I did this one. Let's see if I can get it. Okay. I did this pen with um, uh, a piece of acrylic. It was like an acrylic piece of paint, acrylic paint that I just 
you know, it hardened on my uh, palette and I uh, scraped it off when it was dry. And then I uh, collaged on top of it and I used a rose petal that was actually a real rose petal. And I also used um, one of my paintings. You can actually see, and there'll be photos of this too. Um, I put resin on the whole entire thing and um, added a little a little word that says women see or woman see and um, this is also done with all recycled materials and this also is something that I do with um, with my work you can see a little bit better okay um, I use various different kinds of paints metallic paints and iridescent paints and because I love the idea of it looking like it's very ancient, almost like um, ancient amulets that people wore a long time ago. So this is um, an example of some of my work, and some of my work that will be seen at um, at Eve Avery's. And also I'm planning on uh, showing them and selling them on Etsy after Thanksgiving. So thank you. Bye-bye.